Welcome back planner friends. I'm Jenny with Jenny's Got a Plan and today we are going to be planning in my mini happy planner. Um, my layout is a dashboard but I'm using these blackout pages um, this week. I just trimmed some of this filler paper down with my paper cutter to fit in my mini planner and we are going to use a little reusable Starbucks cup and a jelly pen to make our days and then we will decorate from there. I was trying to use this um, We Are Memory Keepers tool, but I'm not that great at it yet. So we are just going to use our cup and call it close enough. And hopefully my skill has improved since I did this in my skinny classics. Let's see how we do here. Let's see. Not terrible, okay. Could be worse, but could be better. <laughs> Definitely outside the comfort zone, but I feel like that's important, even for something as silly as a planner spread. So let's see. I don't know why I'm trying to make it even. It's not like it matters. Okay, <laughs> poor little guy. So I think what I'll do is the jelly pen smudges a little. So before I let it um, set, I'm just going to draw some like rough lines around it so it doesn't look quite so perfect. And I feel like it just, I don't know. Looks like my mess ups are on purpose if I do it like this. Don't know if that's true or not, or if it's just something I think. Just makes it look a little bit more homemade and it's kind of fun, I'm not gonna lie. Okay. See, we disguise that smudge. Cute. So we'll let that dry there. So we've got Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. And we'll do Thursday and Friday and then figure out what we wanna do with our weekend. Okay. Cute. And then, I don't know. Maybe I'll go just a touch bigger on the weekend. We'll use the bottom of the cup, or the top, I guess. That looks like a little dopey Olaf, doesn't it? Kind of cute. All right, so now we'll make our imperfect circles around it. Okay. That turned out pretty cute, right? So then, while that one dries, we'll go ahead and date our planner. Okay, so we've got that dated, so I'm gonna get this sticker book out of the way. And then I've got some cute, like, black and white washi that I forgot to use on my skinny classic spread so we're just gonna pop some washi over here we've got some cute little spider webs let's see where do we want to put a spider web oops i think i want it over just a little bit closer to the edge cute and then maybe we'll do a it's fine, I'm fine. Seems like a Friday thing for this spread. Cute. 
don't. And then maybe we will do some little floral to make a floral wreath like we did on our other spread. Which flower could we use? Hmm. I don't see any big flowers. I think I'm gonna have to buy another set of these sheets because they are perfect for making these little wreaths. So cute. In fact, I wonder if I should get crafty and see if I could make a floral wreath. What do you think? Maybe I can do it. Oh, that's terrible start, but let's see what we can do. Pulled out my other page. Um, let's see, it looks like there's just little leaves. sure what kind of flower that is but it looks cute and then maybe we'll do one of those little stick things don't they draw like little berries on it and stuff cute and then maybe we'll try and draw one of these big flowers it looks like it's got like a center and then some pretty leaves, or petals, I mean. Cute. Uh, maybe we'll do some more, like, stick-looking things. Okay. <laughs> A little gimpy, but what do you do? And then maybe we'll try and draw another flower. It looks like there's some big old petals. We'll just draw kind of a center looking thing. And then maybe we'll draw some stick thing coming out of it. Wow. People on TikTok better fear my art. <laughs> oh, Jenny. I might do the same thing over here though because it takes up some space and it's kind of cute. So let's see. We'll draw like a petal. We'll draw some lines coming out of it. Not gonna lie, I feel like Bob Ross right now. Okay. And then there's like, I don't know, this thing that's got different leaves coming off of it. Some more dots, okay. And then maybe we'll draw like a big line. And this just has like little flowers coming off of it. Okay. And then maybe we'll draw one more flower, but maybe we'll make it kind of small. Oh, look at my dopey little art. Cute. Um, so then I think we'll call that good for Thursday. So we'll just draw some little dots here. And then for Friday, I think I'm going to layer one of these unhappy planner little crossbone guys over here because I think they're cute. just add some dots over here 
And then maybe we'll try lettering the weekend. dry and then over here I think I'm going to add one more actual flower and then maybe we'll just add some dots Oh my gosh, for my first time for a blackout spread, I am not mad at it. It could be better, there's clearly room to grow, but it was fun to try. Thank you so much for planning along with me, this was so fun. Um, I would love to see your blackout spreads. Um, feel free to like this video, subscribe to my channel, and I can't wait to plan with you next time.